Hi, this is Farjana. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to make a fully custom design product page using DV4. And then I will apply this design for all product page by default. So let's get started. So I'm just taking some pro dummy product here and just clicking one and just view it. So this is the default product page style from DV and it's not looking so good here. So I'm just going to edit it and I'm just leaving the sidebar to no sidebar and update it. I'm going to DV Builder. So I'm going to front end view. And from here, we can access or edit every single section and style it. But I want to style this page from scratch. So I um, just want to remove this section. Also it and just starting a new section with two columns and left side. Um, okay, first I'm just increasing the column size to 100% and adding um, background color on the left side column. Just adding dark color here. And Adding her first product title, so U title, and just here is our product title by default. And I'm changing the style, so using font family and font width and color also. Okay. And I'm adding some padding space with this column for left and right and top to bottom top and bottom same and then I'm adding product description full description here and styling it Changing text color to white. And then we can add product review. So, O review. Sorry, O rating. And changing color also. O rating, we can add orange color. And for text color to white then we can add product price okay and so changing style here so white color and font style and font weight just increasing the font size and also just adding some CSS yeah, to this letter, just old price decreasing a bit. Okay, and adding some CSS here for breaking this line display block and need some line height for price. Okay. And adding the button for add to cart so add to cart okay and styling it again so button custom style we are going to add white color and button background okay and border width removing and radius also removing and 
adding some space adding okay and the size and decreasing it and adding more and okay and adding some padding for top and bottom okay and left to right yes yes it's looking good now and okay. that's it and okay and right side we are going to add our image and First, we are going to our in row section and just adding some space on the top of the image 100 pixel top and bottom 100 pixel. So, just I am styling it, not necessary, and uh, size. And just equalizing height and also remove need to cut the width to zero so I'm again okay cut the width uh, one yeah so no space between them and also adding some style with image so I'm just um, Adding some margin on left side, minus margin. So it's looking some different. I like this style, so I'm doing it and adding some border and just white color. It's looking gorgeous now. And here I also adding some more padding on that side also yes and okay bit more yes okay yes it's looking good yeah and we can also style this so changing the background color and also button color the pink part so I am styling it again uh, button background color um, text color white and that's it okay. So I'm adding so okay looks good. So I'm adding a new section here, bottom and adding a review section and okay so we can also customize this section from style just Title style and just review color. We are taking this color and applying here. Okay, it's not okay. Style so you can change any section by clicking here and also changing this button style okay looks great so also the new section below for related product so adding a new section here and just increasing our column width 
100% and changing product number to 4 and column 4 okay and we can even customize this section of title and price we can style any section color looking great just click it and just change it it's very simple now yes so increasing font size just click here and just increase a bit no okay just just add here it's okay now okay so you can also change the title product title yeah so this is looking good now save it so this is we are just saving this layout name single product page now we will uh, add this uh, style for all product page by default so so when we check on other product products Okay, I'm just going here on others product page you can see also default style there but I need this style will apply for all page by default because it's so much time consuming to design a single page so I want to apply it for globally just creating a template here for all product and create template and add from library just taking our last page and product one okay just save it and now check it again yes so it's working for other space too by default and also for this page yeah it's also working for all page now so I hope you understand the basic concept how we can apply this design for all product page by default so it's very easy in now bb4 so this will help you and thanks for watching welcome to my next video